good morning you guys i just woke up clearly like literally just woke up but i'm gonna be vlogging today because there's so much that still has to be done around this place so this is gonna be another moving in vlog pretty much organizing putting everything away and all that so welcome back to my channel if you are new here i just moved into my own place by myself um a couple days ago it's been a few days i moved in on wednesday today's saturday so i've been here for like three days so far today is going to be fully unpacking and all that so this is going to be a very interesting vlog but i'm going to brush my teeth really quickly and then i'll show you updates to the place because i did some stuff yesterday didn't film yesterday took a little break but i'll show you guys what you have missed but make sure you subscribe if you have not already i'd love to have you part of the fam and let's get into the video okay just brush my teeth let's show you updates to this place so i cleaned off all of my um sink right here for the bathroom it's pretty organized i just threw stuff in these drawers so i need to get some drawer organizers and stuff but down here has all my stuff. I did a few loads of laundry yesterday, like washed all my sheets, my towels, all that. So that was nice. So we've got stuff folded in there, which is good. I also took yesterday to clean like counters and stuff. So um, I cleaned off all the counters and the kitchen and stuff like that. This is something that needs to get done today. This is a mess. <laughs> I actually picked up this rug from World Market yesterday. I think it's so cute. The only thing is it's like two inches too long, which is really upsetting. And I need to figure out what to do because I'm not leaving it like that. But if you have any tips on what to do with this, please let me know. I might try to just put something heavy on this so that it creases. Please let me know. I don't know. I think it's really cute though. And then into my room, I did a little bit of organization. So I set up my clothing rack. My bed is all set up pretty much a little fake plant over there my tv is still on the ground and then i set up my desk to be facing the window because i love that sunlight <laughs> i set up this little chair yesterday built it from home depot i think it's so cute so excited i literally haven't done really anything else in this living room yet but that's what i'm gonna tackle today i need to unpack all these boxes over here so that we can start building some furniture i don't know if you saw this but keiko built this little entryway table and then in the kitchen pretty much the same it's all organized though and clean which is nice yesterday i broke down all of those boxes because that was a huge mess the other day so now it's easy to just grab and bring to the recycling whenever my new um chair covers came in yesterday from amazon they're these ones chair slip covers from Subrotex, Subrotex Home Decor. I don't know. They have this little design on them, but I need to take those ones off, put these ones on. This is the dining table. It's going to be built today. And that's pretty much it. We're also picking up we as in Keiko and I because he's going to come over today and help me um, unpack more and build some stuff. So he'll come over in the next few hours, but um, we're also going to go pick up a TV console from OfferUp because I found it on there for a hundred bucks. So we're gonna go get that. It's about 20 minutes away. Bring that back in here. So that's exciting. And then after that, I honestly think all my big, most of my big purchases are all done, which is very, feels very good. I also purchased a rug yesterday on Rugs USA. It's really cute. I'll show you guys when it gets here, but it's supposed to get here in like a week. So I have time until that. But this chair is honestly pretty comfy and it's really cute and trendy. I looked literally everywhere for a brown leather chair and could not find one. For an affordable price, they were all literally like $500, $600 and I'm like, I'm not spending that on a chair. So I found this one on Home Depot's website and it was like one something, which was a steal. I'm very happy about this chair. I love it. So yeah, I think what I'm going to do right now is go fill up my water and then start unpacking these boxes. I do need to shower eventually, but I'll probably wait a little bit to do that because it's still pretty cold and I don't really feel like showering right now. But let's fill up my water and then get to unpacking. Okay, I also just grabbed a banana because I need some fuel for today because it's gonna be a busy unpacking day. Is done. If you're confused as to why I'm putting things in this box, it's because I'm going to place this box in the outside storage, which is stuff that I don't need right now. So, yeah. Okay, this is the craziness we're working with. This whole box is stuff that's going to go out in the in the storage. Those are empty. 
This is just a bunch of stuff I took out that I'm gonna have to put away. But we've got three more boxes. I think two of those are honestly clothes. So just that one that we have left. I told you guys, I don't have that much stuff. <laughs> Now to turn around and back again I made my bed Okay, I just put that stuff out in the storage I think I'm gonna put all of my kitchen stuff in the kitchen first I've got all of these tampons and pads Thanks to 7th generation <laughs> I'm literally stocked for like 5 months so I have all of this decor and I don't know what the heck to do with it yet because obviously like nothing's set up So I don't really know where to put anything. Also a lot of it was hung on my wall and I am gonna hang stuff on my wall eventually but as of right now I'm not gonna nail anything yet But I thought I would stick this plant in here How cute! Okay, well that's that's good <laughs> Okay, I just randomly placed some things right here. They're probably not gonna stay but it is what it is for right now. Um, I think it's time to start organizing my closet because a lot of the stuff I have out there is gonna go like on the little storage shelves up there probably. So I guess let's start doing that. This is probably what's gonna take the most time but it's gonna be the most satisfying so I'm also very excited for it. But yeah, let's, let's start tackling this closet I guess. So I am for sure going to have to buy some closet organizers like bins to go up there and maybe even some like a little shelf to go right there too. But as of right now, I don't have any of that yet i just kind of wanted to put everything away before i started to um like organize it all also these two bags are giveaway or poshmark but don't know yet so i need to get those out of there and then this is a bunch of things of like random pillows and stuffed animals and stuff so that's probably gonna go in the closet outside as soon as i double bag it so nothing gets inside of this probably get these two out of here too okay i think i'm gonna start by taking all the trash bags off of the hangers um and then start to like organize the clothes that are being hung already. So I'm just gonna rip these bags off. I need scissors. Let's take a spaceship out on the sky, fly to the moon, and take out a sky space one and clay. Okay, so all the stuff is off of the trash bags. Now I need to go in and organize it all. I think I'm going to do jackets and outerwear and then crewnecks and then dresses and then tops and stuff. Honestly, I don't know yet, but it's going to be kind of a mess. So let's just speed organize and try to figure this out together. Oh, baby, I've been waiting. Okay, I have a little update. I have dresses, jackets, I'm in the process of putting up my crewnecks. I have long sleeves, sweaters, and t-shirts, and then I have all my um, tank tops and stuff here. I threw all my hoodies up there because I'm going to fold them, but I'm taking a little break to go get coffee with my sister. I'm going to go pick her up because she's only like 10 minutes away now. And we're gonna go to this really good coffee place called um, Bird Rock. It's so good. So I'm gonna go before it starts raining again because it's supposed to rain all week and I'm not prepared for that. So I'm gonna leave right now and I'll update you when I'm with her. Look who's back. Hello. And we're so yeah. close now. Yep, exactly nine minutes away. I know. What even was this coffee? I don't remember. Uh, on the receipt it said sal salted caramel. The flavor of the dairy-free is salted caramel too today. Yeah. So what a coincidence. There's probably no one there too since I know. it's raining and cold. Mm -hmm. But we went to this coffee place called Bird Rock. It's so good. Got it once before, so we're back. <laughs> we're back. But look, oh my gosh, at the froth. They need <laughs> the full effect. Yeah, you need to Yours looks better. Because I have three shots, so it's darker. True. There's a raindrop. Look at this. Yum. Yum. Can't you just smell it? Yes. <laughs> oh, so good. Oh, this foam this is, is so good. Mm. <laughs> mm. It's so good. And then ah, they ah. have a bunch of ah. vegan <laughs> pastries. And they have a blueberry lemon scone. Oh my gosh. It smells so good. Oh, oh it looks like... so good. Oh my gosh. Look at this. And it's huge too. The... 
Yeah, the video doesn't do it justice. No. Sorry. You also can't smell it. <laughs> oh my. Blueberry? I love I blueberry. Know. Blueberry and lemon? Mm -hmm. <gasps> I think the glaze is probably lemon. Ah! <laughs> <gasps> oh my gosh, it looks so good. Mm. That's so good. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yeah, the glaze is lemon. Oh! I have to try to make that. Mm -hmm. Something like that. Wow. You could easily. Right now, every time we come here, we're going to spend like $10. I know. But we're not going <laughs> to... Well, now, I don't know. I was like, we're not going to come here that often. But, <laughs> but it did start raining, and now it's like it was pouring for a second. Fun. Be careful what you wish for. We're in Walmart now, getting some stuff, and a very exciting purchase. Aww. That is exciting. I am so excited. Yay. Is that the that? No. All right, just got home from hanging out with Brittany. We got coffee, went to Walmart, and I got some stuff that I thought I would show you. Some organizational stuff, and then also just some necessities that I didn't have yet. So, for one, but I picked up this three drawer thing just for um, like my socks, my underwear, bathing suit, stuff like that. And then I also, this is also upside down. <laughs> I picked up this three drawer. I mean, three shelf unit for all my bottoms, like my jeans and my shorts and all that stuff to put in my closet. And then my most exciting purchase, I'm so excited for this. This is an Espresso Virtuo Plus. And I'm so excited that they had that in store because I haven't been able to find one online in stock. So they had this one and I got very excited. So I'm excited about that. I also got a couple organizational things. So I have this drawer organizer, probably for my bathroom drawer because it's very big. I got some more bins, so a couple small ones, little mini ones, and then this big heavy duty bin, and then one more bag of stuff. And I'll show you what I got. So I got some paper plates slash bowls just to come in handy. I'm not gonna use them all the time, obviously, but if, I don't know, I don't know. I think I. They'll come in handy if I ever need to use them. I finally found some Lysol, Lysol wipes, just the disinfecting ones. I couldn't find these anywhere because they've been out of stock, obviously because of Corona. I bought pepper and salt because my salt and pepper shakers didn't come with it because I was dumb and thought they did, but they didn't. So I'm stocked on this. That's a necessity. I also got some creamed corn because my sister has this super good um, cornbread recipe. It literally tastes like cake, but she uses the Marie Callender's cornbread mix with a bunch of some other things. Um, so I might make that. Actually, no, I can't make it because I need milk and I didn't have any milk yet, but I got cream corn for that. I also got some sleeping gummies because I've been having a really, really, really hard time falling asleep at night. Um, I literally just stay awake and I can't sleep and I don't know what it is, but I got some of these. They're melatonin, chamomile, and passion flower just to help me sleep if I have another restless night. I've been meaning to get these for so long and then I just keep forgetting, so I finally got those. And then Keiko and I are a huge fan of Cholula hot sauce, and I didn't have any, so I got the original, and then also I found this chili garlic one, which sounds so good, but I haven't tried it, but it's probably delicious, so I'm very excited <laughs> about these, which is so random. Also, yes, Keiko is still supposed to come over today, but he's sleeping right now um, because he got the vaccine yesterday because um, they offered it for the firefighter recruits and stuff, so he got it, but he hasn't been feeling really good, so he's taking a nap, um, and he hasn't been answering me, and we were supposed to pick up the TV console at 3 from an off-rep person, but it's 3 o'clock now, <laughs> and I don't know when he's coming, so hopefully he's okay, but I'm gonna put all this stuff away, and then probably start, probably go back to organizing my closet, because that's really, really what I'm gonna get done today. Okay, so this whole box is full of crewnecks and sweats and stuff, so I'm gonna hang up the crewnecks, over there and then I'm gonna end up putting the sweats probably on the shelf that I'm gonna build if they all fit but we'll see but I'm gonna hang all the crew necks first okay and then this is just all of my sweats that will go on a shelf so like I said I got this little three drawer thing from Walmart it was very cheap, like $10, I think. And it's perfect for all the stuff, you know, that can't go on a shelf. So I'm gonna put all my sports bras and all of that jazz in here, but I'll show you when I'm done. So I think I'm gonna attempt to build this shelf for myself right now so that I can finish um, doing my closet. So let's build a bookcase. <laughs> okay, 
there she is. We're already getting a lot more organized in here. That has my underwear sports bras. This has my socks and that has my bathing suits in it. And now I'm gonna put all of my bottoms on those shelves. Look who's here. Totally forgot to film this, but I just put all my decor on this shelf for now. I don't know what to do with it yet. So it's a lot cleaner in here now. He's gonna cut some um, wooden sticks to put like in the sliding door for extra security. But I did that. And then, I don't know if I showed you. This is what my closet looks like as of right now. I still need to put all my bottoms on there. But I put my sweats and shorts down there. So it's looking pretty good in here. And still a mess out here. But we're gonna go pick up nightstands that I found on Facebook Marketplace. And then a TV console, a different one, that I found on OfferUp. So we're gonna make a couple trips. Try to do it before it gets dark, even though it's gonna get dark any second now. And then come back here. Okay, here's the update. We picked up my TV console. The guy was so nice and he gave us two free bar stools too, but he's gonna take them and he moves. That's what it looks like. Super cute. And he's gonna start putting together the dining room table. I'm gonna take all these covers off and put the new covers on. And then make dinner. They look so good, like brand new. And they're so comfy too. Wow, we're just full of reselling deals. How's the table building going? Just finished dinner, well, making dinner. Spinach tortellini with ground chicken and vodka sauce. Pasta. You put and oregano in it? This, yes. And this man. Look at my table, my chairs. I'm obsessed with this. So cute. Perfect table, and yeah, it's extendable, so you add another part on it, and then it pulls out. It comes out to like right here. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Or it can just be a four seater like this. Um, I got these off of, I mean, from Ikea. That's a bunch of random stuff from a bunch of places. And I already told you about these chairs, but it's so cute. Okay. I'm ready to. Now we're gonna eat and watch a Bachelor. Mm -hmm. Yay. We just ate dinner and watched a little bit of the Bachelor. And then this table was so easy to build, but look how beautiful it is. Why do I love it so much? The top is glass and then the bottoms are like a mirror. I think it's so cute. Tomorrow, this is what we're gonna tackle. All this cardboard and trash is gonna be gone. Then I actually have room to put things. I don't know where we put that. Well, I'll put it in the storage. Look how beautiful this machine is. Well, it's high tech. Wait, how'd you open it? Oh, up. That's very cool. Damn. Here's the little sampler box. Oh my gosh. It tells you which ones are a coffee, which ones are espresso, oh, did which come ones with are a double. Usable cap container? Capsule container? Used capsule container. Did you bunch them? I know I like this one and this one. And I'm excited to show the double shot one. So this one, I guess, is double shot. Oh yeah, I'm excited. Well, we'll try this out tomorrow morning for the first time. Did I even show you guys my nightstands? I just got two cute nightstands, two for $30 on Facebook Marketplace. And they're in such good condition. Well, that one, I don't know what's wrong with the bottom, but they just have little drawers. And I think they're really cute. I already cleaned them and stuff, but adorable. Basic, just what I wanted. So cute. I'm probably gonna like change this hardware or just paint it black or something to match, but I think it's cute. But I'm gonna end this vlog here because I filmed so much today and we're just gonna watch Bachelor and go to sleep. So I'll see you guys next time I vlog. I don't know when that'll be, but thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much. I hope you're enjoying all the moving content and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.